Let's talk about getting it going for uh, real here and putting on the Arizona uniform. Oh man, it's big. Everybody's excited. We are ready. You know, I didn't work so hard from the summer to now to get here and I'm ready to start playing. What's going to be the biggest difference from JC ball to play in D1 level? Um, just a more busy schedule. I mean, just the whole process of always having to do something. Waking up from the morning all the way to nighttime, you're always doing something. And I think that's the biggest thing. You kind of described as a guy who uh, can shoot the three, yet you'll go and hit the boards. Uh, is that your game, or do you do more than that? I mean, um, I'm very versatile. Um, I can do more than that. Um, I can add a bunch of things to my game, um, shoot, dribble, um, crash the boards, defense, just a lot of things like that. What's it been like so far the first couple months on campus? How have the guys embraced you and how have things gone so far? Well, everything's been great. I mean, I have nothing but love from all the players. Showed me a lot of love and um, everything's been good. Uh, you guys obviously battle and pick up. Uh, anyone impress you? Anyone been a handle for you? Hard to handle? Um, um, everybody impressed me. You know, um, we went out there and pick up every day, um, play hard. You know, we had pick up, we play hard. And everyone impressed me. Obviously, you coming from the Midwest. What's the reputation of Arizona now with a couple down years have been uh, to guys from where you're from? To me, um, it's still up. And everybody still thinks that. Um, it's still an up program. I mean, even though the coaches switch, it's still an up program. It's still a big program. What was it about Arizona that, that attracted you? Obviously, you could have gone to a lot of different places, but you chose to come here. I think it was just the, the history of Arizona. And actually, the new coach, um, Sean Miller, I actually believed in um, what he was telling me and everything like that. And I just think Arizona is one of those schools I always grew up watching. And I, and I always wanted to come here, so that's why I picked the school. Are there some players uh, you remember uh, in that Wildcat uniform? Anyone maybe uh, who, who turned your head or you keep following in the pros? Or? Um, Andre Iguodala's, um, like the recent guys, um, Chase Bunnicker, um guys, um, Jerry Bayless, and um, a lot of other guys that um, actually played the same position with me that was like four or three type guys, and they really being successful in the league right now. Do you think you're going to see any time at the three, or are you going to be primarily at the four this year? To be honest with you, I don't know. I, I'm just ready to go out there and play hard and win. What do you have to do to, to get into that uh, rotation and maybe uh, steal a starting job? Play hard. That's all you got to do. You play hard, I mean, the sky's the limit. For those of us who've only seen a few YouTube clips here and there, or, you know, not a whole lot of you, who do you play like? Is there an NBA player or college player your game most resembles? Um, I can't really say. Um, I actually don't know how I play. I think I play pretty much like myself. You know, um, as of now, yeah, I play like myself. Is there anyone you've bonded with on this team? Any guy who's, you know, maybe you're a little tighter with than others? Or is it well, um, everybody. Everybody's pretty much equal. I mean, we're like a team, and we try to value everything as a team, so everybody I bonded with. Perfect. Thank you.